Welcome back to Live It Fit Now. Eat more, weigh less. Brand new segment that we have on the show, and I'm joined here by my program's director, Erica. Hey, Erica. Hi, how's it going? Erica, going great. We have breakfast. All right, most important meal of the day. I it, love it. It is, mm -hmm. and it's got to be the right meal, of course, for our clients. Oh, absolutely. Many of our clients come in very early in the morning. We're busiest between, what would you say? Probably between five and seven. So most people come in on an empty stomach. They usually eat after their workout, which we recommend. We do recommend that you eat after you work out. Mm -hmm. You always want to keep your blood sugar level low while you're training so you drop right. more fat. In terms of eating after your workout, so around a non-workout day, right. this unfortunately is something that I would not recommend. Oh no, and it's a very common one too. I think most of my clients when they first started, cereal for breakfast, oatmeal for breakfast, quick, easy, common. Yeah, it is common, and it'll also cause a tremendous amount of fluctuation of your blood sugar level, causing it to go way up, right. and then your body to release insulin and then store it as fat. We don't want that. Mm -hmm. But instead, we want something in its place. Exactly. We're going to bring it in right now. Oh, it smells so good. Chef Binks. Wow. You guys hungry? <laughs> yes. All right. Breakfast, as you said, the most important meal of the day. Mm -hmm. Loaded with sugar and bad carbs, packed with protein and flavor. Eggs, a little bit of grilled chicken, some broccoli, and some, a little bit of cheddar cheese, some sweet potato, and some turkey sausage. Lean protein, highly absorbable protein, mm -hmm. and packed with flavor. This is the way that I would recommend that all of my clients start the day. It's the way that I feed them, exactly. Chef, I'm not comparing the eggs to this bowl of cereal. I'm comparing the eggs and the sausage and the potatoes to probably about a half a cup of this. Yeah, well, exactly. You could eat two or three bowls of cereal, right? I mean, yeah. you're not going to eat one bowl of that. You're well, not going to full after that. No, not, not full at all, not for any length of time. This will mm -hmm. pack your stomach with wonderful flavor. And on top of that, though, you could probably eat 10 of those omelets for what you would do to your blood sugar yeah. level Easily. with just that bowl of Easily. sugar. Don't eat 10 omelets. <laughs> but still, though, that's how much of a difference it really is. It's not a fair comparison at all. With a lot of our clients, and I know we have a lot of female clients as well, we want to make sure that they're eating the right amount of protein, especially to nourish their muscle. Oh, absolutely. I think so. If they want to drop the most amount of fat, you got to eat right for it. you got to eat right to drop a lot of fat. Mm -hmm. What do you say right now? We head into the kitchen and we show people how to put together an awesome, delicious lunch. 